If you're looking for the best cross and bicross hearing aids, then you're watching the right video. Hey guys, Cliff Olson, doctor of audiology and founder of Applied Hearing Solutions in Phoenix, Arizona. And in this video, I'm talking about the best cross and bicross hearing aids of 2025. If you're someone with single-sided deafness, one of the absolute best treatment options that you have is cross treatment. Cross stands for contralateral routing of signal. And it basically means that you're taking sound from your bad ear using a cross transmitter and sending it over to a hearing aid in your good ear. And if you also have hearing loss in your better hearing ear, we call this bicross treatment because we are also amplifying the sound once it gets over to your better hearing ear. Generally speaking, treating single-sided deafness with either cross or bicross is a lot more complex than just treating a standard case of hearing loss, which means that it is a very good idea to find a hearing care professional who follows comprehensive audiologic best practices. And the best way to find one of these extremely rare providers is to go to my website, hearingup.com, and finding a HearingUp network member in your area. HearingUp members have been vetted and are committed to following comprehensive audiologic best practices when fitting and programming your cross hearing aids. So if hearing your absolute best is important to you, finding a Hearing Up Network member in your area is an absolute must. That being said, let's go ahead and take a look at all of the best cross transmitters that you can get here in 2025, starting with the Phonak Cross Infineo. The Cross Infineo from Phonak is a rechargeable cross transmitter that's compatible with the Phonak Adeo Infineo R. This cross transmitter is not compatible with Phonex new Sphere Infineo hearing aid, which means that you will not be able to get all of the cool features of the Deep Sonic chip for using AI to separate speech from background noise, but you do get access to the new Era chip. Released in late 2024, Phonex new version of this cross transmitter has much better battery life than previous generations of their technology. This means that you can get at least 16 hours of battery life on a single charge with this cross transmitter as opposed to around 11 hours that you would previously get. Phonak has always been known as an excellent option to treat single-sided deafness because they've been doing cross and bicross treatment at a high level for decades at this point, all the way back to when you actually had a wire that connected the cross transmitter over to the hearing aid in your better hearing ear. Inside the professional programming software, your hearing care professional can adjust the cross balance to make sure that they're actually overcoming the head shadow effect for you so you can hear all the sounds on your bad side in your better hearing ear. The Cross Infineo can also be connected to the MyPhoneX smartphone app, so you have full adjustment capabilities and you even have access to remote care with your hearing care professional. Streaming from pretty much any smartphone is also possible using this cross transmitter, although when you're streaming audio into your better hearing ear, the cross transmitter is not active. Another exciting thing here is that Phonak did upgrade their Infineo platform with Bluetooth version 5.3, which means that you get twice the range of Bluetooth connectivity with these particular devices. And this new version of Bluetooth will also give you access to Bluetooth LE Audio and AuraCast whenever that becomes more widely available. You'll be able to get a firmer update from your hearing care professional with these devices. You also get access to the full lineup of all of Phonax excellent wireless accessories, namely the partner mic, as well as the full line of Roger microphones, including the Roger On, Roger Select, and Roger Table mic for individuals who continue to struggle in background noise situations, even though they're using the cross. Overall, the Infineo Cross from Phonak is an excellent choice for cross and by cross treatment here in 2025. Now, something else that is extremely important when it comes to having success with cross treatment is real ear measurement. Real ear measurement is a way for your hearing care professional to verify that the amount of sound that is being transmitted from your cross side to your hearing aid side is actually overcoming the head shadow effect, as well as meeting your hearing loss prescription on your better hearing ear. I am serious when I say this, that it is quite literally impossible to correctly program your cross transmitter to your hearing aid if you are not doing real ear measurement to verify this fitting. Now, if you would like to learn more about verifying a cross fitting, I will have this video linked down in the description. Next on this list of the best cross devices that you can get in 2025 is the Oticon Cross PX. The Cross PX by Oticon is the rechargeable cross transmitter that is quite literally compatible with like almost every hearing aid that Oticon has ever created. This includes the Oticon Intent, the Oticon Real, the Oticon More, the Zircon, the Open S, the Play PX, 
the open play, the exceed, the exceed play, and even the ruby. Keep in mind that this rechargeable cross transmitter does not actually fit inside of the newest hearing aid by Oticon, which is the Oticon Intense, but it does fit inside the same charger as the Oticon More and the Oticon Real. In terms of performance, the Oticon Cross PX works the best with the Oticon Intent, the Oticon More, and the Oticon Real hearing aids because all of these hearing aids use their deep neural network for sound processing. This deep neural network is basically an artificial human brain that gets fed with a ton of different sound samples, in this case 12 million different sound samples, for it to identify what makes speech speech and noise noise. And it does this much more accurately than a human-made algorithm would. The whole purpose of doing this is to help you better separate speech from background noise when you're in a noisy situation. In the Oticon programming software, your hearing care professional can easily switch between a cross or by cross fitting, and they can adjust the cross balance. Not to mention they can fully customize the amount of amplification that they're putting into the hearing aid in your better hearing ear, and if you happen to have a high frequency hearing loss in your better hearing ear, there is really no hearing aid that is better than an Oticon hearing aid. If you want Bluetooth low energy with AuraCast capabilities, the Oticon Intent hearing aids have you covered, but you do not get this feature with some of the older generations that this cross transmitter is compatible with. If you would like to use an assistive listening device, you can still use the Oticon Connect Clip to act as a remote microphone in a noisy situation for you. You can still use the Oticon Companion app to make adjustments on your hearing devices, and if you have an Apple Watch, you also get this Oticon Companion app on the Apple Watch so you don't have to break out your phone phone every single time you want to make an adjustment. If getting a cross transmitter from a company who has virtually mastered cross and by cross treatment here in 2025, I would highly recommend that you at least consider the Oticon Cross PX. Now one thing that is hugely important for individuals with single-sided deafness is auditory training. When you only have one functioning ear, it is incredibly important that you get the most out of that ear, and the best way to do that is to do auditory training with Lace AI Pro. Lace AI Pro is an auditory training app that has been used for over 20 years and over 80 research articles validating its ability to significantly improve how well you hear, particularly in background noise. Research shows that training with Lace AI Pro can result in up to a six decibel improvement in signal to noise ratio, which is massive. To get Lace AI Pro, you have to purchase a license, and this license gives you lifetime access to this app, including any new features that they roll out in the future. But for Dr. Cliff channel subscribers, you can get Lace AI Pro at a significant discount that I will have linked in the description. That being said, the next cross transmitter to make this year's list of best cross devices in 2025 is the Signia Cross Silk Charge & Go iX. The Signia Silk is by far the smallest cross transmitter available on the market right now. It is also an instant fit device, which means that your hearing care professional can fit you rather quickly with it because they do not need to take a custom ear mold of your ear canal. They can actually fit it with a rubber dome or rubber sleeve. However, if they choose to, they can still make a custom ear mold for you that attaches to the end of this device for better retention inside of your ear canal. Not only is the Cross Silk device compatible with the Signia Silk Charge & Go iX, but it is also compatible with the invisible in the canal and completely in the canal version of the Inseo iX. Now you may have caught on that the name of this device is rather long, but the Charge & Go part of its name means that this cross transmitter is actually rechargeable. Now previous generations of this Signia Silk cross transmitter used a size 10 disposable battery, but they have gotten away from the disposable batteries and just in the nick of time because these new battery packaging laws that basically prevent you from getting your batteries out of the packaging makes it very difficult to use disposable batteries anymore. Now I will say that actually programming and verifying the programming of this cross transmitter is very difficult to do, but once you get it done and get it done well, the performance of this tiny little device is pretty impressive. You can also control some of the functionality of the Signia Silk devices with the smartphone. It doesn't have Bluetooth connectivity, but your phone will actually emit chirping sounds to communicate with your devices. So if you actually want to make volume adjustments or program adjustments, you basically enter those adjustments into your Signia app and it will make a chirping sound to send those adjustments into your hearing aids. Now this cross transmitter can also be set up in cross or by cross mode. I will say though that when you're using by cross mode, you're rather limited to the amount of amplification that you can actually put into your better hearing ear. So this device really isn't suitable for anyone that has more than a moderate level hearing loss. If that's you and you 
still want to stay inside of the Signia family, Signia also has cross transmitters for the receiver and canal technology that you should check out as well. But if a completely in the canal cross transmitter option is what you're looking for, you should really consider the Signia Cross Silk Charge and Go IX here in 2025. All right, guys, if you're enjoying this video so far, do me a huge favor and click the like button. It really helps out my channel. And if you are not yet subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on, go ahead and do that as well. It is greatly appreciated. And let me know down in the comment section if you use a cross transmitter and which cross transmitter you use and how much you like it. All right, and the last cross transmitter to make this year's list of best cross devices in 2025 is the Starkey Edge AI RIC RT Cross. Now, Starkey technically has a rechargeable version version of this cross transmitter and a non-rechargeable version of this cross transmitter, but I prefer the rechargeable version for the same reasons why I did not like the disposable battery option for Signia. Starkey has been doing cross with their technologies for around nine years or so, and they have gotten way better at it. The really cool thing about this particular cross transmitter is that you get basically all of the other benefits of the Starkey Edge AI hearing aids. The Edge AI hearing aids now use an integrated deep neural network on their G2 neuroprocessor chip inside of their hearing aids, and it really shines when you use Edge Mode Plus. Edge Mode Plus, which you actually have to toggle on, gives you a significant improvement in signal to noise ratio, anywhere between 10 and 13 decibels, depending on the environment that you're in. This gives you a huge advantage when you get into background noise situations if that's a high priority that you have with this cross transmitter. Heck, you know what? Go ahead and just listen to it yourself. Our goal at Starkey is to remove it with a fear from hearing aid users that they'll miss out on one of life's most important moments due to running out of battery life in their hearing aids. I mean, this Edge Mode Plus feature could quite honestly be the difference between you hearing and understanding what someone is saying and you just pretending to hear and understand what they say. The way that Starkey has their deep neural network integrated into their G2 neuroprocessor chip actually lowers the battery drain of using this deep neural network. Although with 51 hours of battery life on a single charge, I doubt that you will ever run out of battery when you're wearing this cross transmitter. The Edge AI Cross is also fully customizable by your hearing care professional. And if you have really bad hearing in your better hearing ear, your hearing care professional can even hook you up with a custom ear mold on your better hearing ear to trap in more amplification and give you better hearing. Yes, this Edge AI option is also equipped with Bluetooth LE audio and AuraCast, so if that's something Something that's important to you, this is definitely a hearing aid to consider. And if you're impatient and you don't want to wait for AuraCast to become more available, this particular cross transmitter is compatible with the RT version of the RIC hearing aid, which means that it has a telecoil in it. The only real issue that I see about using an Edge AI cross transmitter is that the Edge AI platform does not yet have access to a remote microphone for help in difficult listening situations. But I would hope that Starkey does eventually release a remote microphone at some point in 2025. Well, there you go. Those are the four best cross transmitters that I think are available here in 2025. Let's go ahead and do a quick recap. And keep in mind that I did list these in no particular order. I think all of these devices are great depending on what your specific wants and needs are. But here we go. First, we had the Phonak Cross Infineo that now gives you proven cross and bi-cross performance with all day battery life. Second, we had the Oticon Cross PX that provides cross and bi-cross compatibility across almost every Oticon hearing aid going back years. Third, we had the Signia Cross Silk Charge and Go IX that is the smallest rechargeable completely in canal cross transmitter in existence. And fourth, we had the Starkey Edge AI RIC RT Cross that gives you unrestricted access to every feature of the Edge AI hearing aids, including Edge Mode Plus. Just remember, all of these cross transmitter options for individuals with single-sided deafness work substantially better when you go to a hearing care professional who is experienced in treating single-sided deafness. But assuming you're able to find one of these excellent hearing care professionals, you have some fantastic options when it comes to cross transmitters here in 2025.